everybody, it's Sunday and we are going to go for a little walk. Uh, we woke up pretty late this morning, so I think it's about two o'clock now. Where are we going, Stephanie? We are going to go to um, the flea market, I think, if we make it at Liesenbrunnen, Liesenbrunnen, the, the water area, the uh -huh. water from the mountain, and then maybe to the hammocks at Lüberg. We'll see if we have energy and for sure ice cream. Ice cream for sure. I only have one plan for the day and that is ice cream. Do you have any other plans? Sharif, you left watermarks all over the floor. I don't know. Where? All over the floor, look look under your feet. Well, I'm, I'm just waiting for Sharif to get ready. Men like to say that women take a long time to get ready, but as soon as I finished my makeup and my hair, Sharif started to go into the shower. Still waiting. Two thousand years later. For your mom, right? Yeah. What does it say? Der Grosse Graben. Which means? The Big Ditch. The Big Ditch. Tibby's very upset that Sharif left to go back to the shop because he wanted to get a little um, a trinket. Oh, what trick. There he is. There he is. Does she notice? Now she knows. Oh, look, Tibby. Look. Sometimes juice and beer. Ju juice? Okay. Hey everybody, so I just came back from the Middle Eastern grocery store. Um, I also went with my friend Netta. We went to go uh, get a coffee beforehand. I had a cappuccino and a pretzel. I shouldn't have. I'm trying to eat lower carb, but I was hungry and they're like 50 cents and they're really good. So I got one of those and then we headed just to the Middle Eastern uh, grocery store. I can't even remember the name of it, but it's um, near Apias Plaza, near the mall. And I got a lot of food. So I'm just gonna show you really quickly what I got. So here is my delicious food haul. I spent in total um, 40, 45 euro. So a little bit more than I did last time, but I got a lot of stuff. I got the donut peaches, which they have a lot in Germany. That's not particularly from, um, it's not like in particular to the Middle Eastern store. It's just, it was a good price. I got two kinds of bread. I got a uh, levna. I got these hot peppers that are pickled. These breadsticks, breadsticks that Sharif asked for. Um, I'm not sure what they're called, but I've seen them many times. Again, more pickled turnips. I got this, which I believe is Bulgarian feta. This was a really good price. I think this was three euro, and in Canada you paid $20 for this, so a lot cheaper. Um, just some rice, broad beans, uh, more olives. These are spicy green olives. Uh, more falafel, more okra. These peppers, these are really, really good peppers. They're not spicy at all. They're just like regular green peppers, but they don't have the fibers that the kind of more green bell peppers have. Um, what's this called again? It's uh, artichokes, uh, black olives, some sausage, and I think that's it. Pretty good haul and not a bad price for sure. It's 
so rainy today and cold. What the hell happened? It was summer, like two weeks ago. We were gonna go to the beach, it was so hot, and now it's just cold. I think it's like, I don't know, maybe 12 degrees or something like that. It's really cold. So as you just saw, it's so rainy, it's so cold today. I can't believe it's supposed to be summer right now, it's July. Um, but thankfully, I'm going to be working from home for the whole day. Um, what do you mean working from home? I don't have a job. Well, I've actually recently taken up, um, or not taken up, I've offered my services online as an, um, not even an English tutor, but someone who's a native speaker that someone who already has some level of English can practice with. Um, so I do have a couple of students, I guess you'd say. I do have a couple people I meet with, uh, either in person or online, and this has been a really good opportunity for me to um, make a little bit of money on the side. No, you may know I don't have a job here in Germany right now. I am learning German and that's been my major focus as my husband works. But this has been a good opportunity for me to make a little bit of money, um, which helps with our bills and I'm really happy to be offering this. Um, I really enjoy speaking with my students and it's just really been a pleasure so far. And I think I'll just end the video here. Uh, don't forget, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And uh, if you consider subscribing, it really helps support my channel. Uh, I'd love to hear from you guys what would you like to see from me in the future? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching.